All right, what's up, Hot Squad? Welcome back to my Hot Banger Recap Marathon. So, we got another Jai Jitsu recap when this recent one just came out. And this is recap for Transformers Bears of the Fallen, and this is called When Optimus Pulled Up on the Fallen and Took His Face. So, I, of course, I've seen Revenge of the Fallen multiple times growing up. I can't believe it came out back in 2009. 2009, it came out. I would think I was still in middle school when it just came out. It's crazy. I think I remember enjoying it, but now I don't like it. It's, uh, it was such a major disappointment, especially coming after the first Transformers movie, which that is one of my favorites of all time. If you have not seen it, yes, I mean, not seen my, my talk, my um, my thoughts about the Transformers movies, yes, the first Transformers movie will always be my favorite in the series. Rivers of Fallen, not really. Doctor Moon, loved it. Not as good as the first one, but still loved it. Age of Station and Last Night, trash, both of them. Riders of Beast actually was pretty good, I gotta say, and Bone Bees actually was great. So, that's my take if you have not seen my takes on the Transformers movies. So, yes, <laughs> so, Hot Squad, what we're gonna do? We're gonna continue recaps, baby, with Jai Jutsu's recap of Transformers Rivers of Fallen. I'm excited to see this. So, Hot Squad, what we're gonna do? Let's check it out, baby. Hit it, hit it, hit it, hit it, get it, get it, get it, get it. Thank you, Jesus. Cast all your anxieties on him because he cares for you. Great quote. Yeah. Time for another banger. 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 So this doofus Sam got up in this dingy old hobo fit picking up the Matrix so they can revive Optimus. Man's really trying to make a statement in the fashion world. Bro <laughs> thinks he's Kanye. <laughs> and tell me why they got this tarp over Optimus like he's used scrap at a junkyard. I know the military praying on my boy downfall. <laughs> gonna turn him into straight rust armor. You put that junk on a human, I bet it's gonna have less armor points than the chainmail armor from Minecraft. <laughs> but Sam climbs up on Optimus' chest and drives the Matrix dead into his sternicus. Man's Optimus woke up like, Oh my god! No! Bro coughed up the first variant of COVID-19 and stood up to get a good stretch in. And the first thing to come out this fool mouth is, boy. Oh my goodness, bro. Who gonna tell him he needs to give Kratos his phrase back? You in the wrong story, my guy. We is not finna fight Odin. Then you got this geezer bot over here on his last leg, fainting because he just saw a prime. Uh, a living prime. <laughs> I can't believe it's amazing. <laughs> just when everybody cooking, thinking stuff sweet, this grimy nigga, the fallen, pulled yep. up like he was Minato, goofy hitting that. Now you see. Now you know. They started punking all these fools. Boy, if it wasn't for the ricochet from his landing, these two soldiers right here was going to get turned into yep. straight baby food. Yep. Bro came for one thing and one thing only. He grabbed that Matrix from Prime's chest, and right before he swerved out of there, he okay. just got to put a foot into this fool Prime's chest. I swear these cons stay disrespecting my boy Optimus like he not known for folding niggas. Now that Optimus battery on low power mode, the Autobots don't know what to do. First they let my man get jumped in the forest, yeah, seriously, and now they couldn't even protect him long enough for him to get his reboot card? Yeah. That's crazy. Me and my niggas could never. We would have been in that forest scrapping, I tell you that. It would have been straight hub caps and windshield wipers flying everywhere. Anyways, the Fallen pulls back up to the pyramid and starts moving like Houdini. Bro, lifting up artillery and jump with the flip of that staff. This is Robo Voldemort in this mug. <laughs> and I know y'all seen them humans get lifted what? up into the sky. If they didn't catch a straight tank to the noggin, this fall right here definitely turned them into grits. Yep. The geezer bot realized he was dead anyways, so he ripped out his core and donated his parts to the Optimus GoFundMe. The <laughs> Go Autobot started linking up, and all we see is Optimus crawling into his new drip. Bro got wings, oh, a tail, blasters, cannons. <laughs> they done turned this nigga into a Megazord. Of course Optimus had to hit that pose and pull out this 90s old caption Let's talking roll. about some Let's roll. Let's roll. Yeah. Like Goofy, where your big body tail rolling to? One oh, roll God. and all the make-a-wish parts falling off your body. The mugs hanging on by the power of friendship. But Optimus rolls out, as he would say, and heads straight for the pyramid. And tell me why these Doodle Bob soldiers running towards the danger like they the X-Factors of this fade. Like if y'all flesh body niggas don't get on somewhere <laughs> before these cons turn you into straight smash burgers, <laughs> these fighter jets pull up hitting formations like they finna fly over a football game just to catch a 10 time boulder blowing them up. That <laughs> one goofy had it thought out though. That first jet flew in with no plan and that last jet was like, heck no, nah, I got kids face tail <laughs> and swerved out of there. Yep. Hey. I don't blame you, my G. Mm -hmm. You would have met the same fate if you would have stayed. Yeah. But Prime 
Ain't worth the sacrifice. Comes in hot like an all pro defensive end tackling the rubble so he could set up that step back dropping a dime into Kobe. that Sun Destroyer contraption. Mans came in with that Mamba mentality. He didn't hit that Kobe fadeaway while being absolutely smothered. <laughs> but we get back to it, and either that explosion set off an EMP, or this fool Optimus forgot how to fly with those paper mache wings after clutching it up. Cause he started- Was that Optimus face supposed to be like, yes, that's great work. That's hilarious, man. Falling down this pyramid, noggin first. I know bro can cuss. <laughs> What's the CTE protocols for these Autobots and Decepticons? Cause he definitely got it. Optimus and the Fallen hit the ruins, and now we finna see some scrapping, boy. The Fallen stood up talking about some die like your brothers. But Optimus hit him with the blast to the test, cause this a family function. They were your brothers too, Goofy. Optimus got bro posted up on the rubble like a sticky note. Then once he grabbed him by the head, Look who we got in the back trying to third party. Yep. This goofy Fingers nigga fine. Megatron peeking around like he wants a cupcake. EDP Tron, that's what I'm gonna call him. Bro thought this was gonna be another forest jump in part two, but Optimus had other plans this time. Oh so he flew all of them into another phase scenery and called for his ones with Megatron. Megatron went for not one, but two heavy slashes, grazing the taco meat off Optimus' chest, but the dog himself parried them mugs. Grabbing Megatron by the arm, Cocking his shotgun blaster back and making him give himself a facial. Got yep. Megatron looking like this nigga. So <laughs> dude tried to hit a sneak attack with that other hand shotty, but got his arm recycled. Then Optimus hit that one knee like he was Kaepernick and turned them jet blasters into a one-way ticket to return to Cybertron. All that jumping just to get bopped up by the one nigga you thought you had put down. Hmm. One combo from Prime. And this goofy out for the count. Gotta be a sad day for Megatron fans. This fool stay getting cooked by Optimus, I swear. And if it wasn't for those jumping tactics in the forest, he would have never seen Egypt in the first place. Ooh, I swear this nigga lame. That's why he's laid out on the dirt like a bad day at the beach. Goofy couldn't even finish his sentence trying to call for Starscream. Cause his face got reorganized into a trash can. Okay. Okay, enough of this dookie stain named Megatron. Now it's time for Optimus and the Fallen to run they ones. Optimus called ISO and immediately went to spam and circle, hitting that spin move to break this incoming rubble. And after that BS attempt by the Fallen to stop Prime, I knew he was cooked. That's low key like the equivalent to a key blast spam. That don't work. Bro, nope. Optimus started firing him up with them hollows just Whoa. so he could put that butter knife in bro's mouth. And right here, I thought he was cookies, boy. I could see his fortune written all on the wall. Had me in the it's theater nuts. as a kid like, Woo! But that jump did not connect because the falling back step and ripped off that yeah. iron on shoulder cannon slapping prime with it. Yeah. And then he tried to pull out that Wukong staff. Wukong. I guess he thought he was finna hit that Spiliobus. But Prime parried that jump, took the staff, and hit him with that spin move. I said spin move. And jabbed that stripper pole dead through his neck, then broke the staff across dude's face. After Bro 2 Pay came off, we see this nigga whole drip was a facade. Cause ain't no way he pulling no Decepticon shawties with that face. Then Optimus made him spread eagle between these pillars before he blew that goofy back out. Hit him with the coldest caption of all time. I know that's going on the ground later. <laughs> Megatron in the back like, This can't be. This can't be. Starscream pulled up and gave bro the most real nigga advice I've heard. Uh, hey player, I ain't trying to call you no hoe, but sometime the hoe gotta go. <laughs> and they dipped off into the sunset. These cons better learn to put some respect on Optimus' name. He literally painting these doodle bobs out every movie. You think they would have caught on by now? Look at him. Mans yeah. came out from behind the Sphinx just to hit his finishing pose. That's a real nigga. Mm -hmm. So why you playing with him? Anyways, I got a banger plan for the next video. But hit 5K likes and I'll do more Transformers. All but right. y'all know what to do. Like, comment, subscribe, and go ahead and buy them heads. Right. Dear Lord. We want to thank you for every day you wake us up. Mm -hmm. You bless us with continued opportunities to not only be closer to you, but to live this life. Mm -hmm. And for that, we simply want to say thank you. We ask for your strength and help for when the times get tough mm -hmm. and for you to remind us that you're always there through it all. Yes. In your name I pray. Amen. Amen. Uh, Jutsu right. Mafia. Hidden Technique. Peace. Great prayer, Jaijutsu. Great prayer. Definitely need that, man. Definitely need that. All right.
Hilarious recap, by the way, man. Hilarious recap. <laughs> but yeah, um, when Optimus got his comeback at the end in Egypt, man, that was, that was, that was pretty awesome. When um, he ripped off the Fallen's face, he's like, give me your face. I was like, yo, and ripped this freaking core out his um his chest like, damn, bro. The Ultimus is an absolute savage, man. But that Force fight, it was the best part of the movie. Not gonna lie, it was the best part of the movie. I mean, shoot, dude. Despite, you know, he got his ass kicked, like, first first time. But, you know, when he said, I take you all on with had two blades, I mean, he was going in, man. He was going in. He was definitely going in. So, overall, W recap, John Jutsu. Keep up the great work. I can't wait for more of your Transformers recaps, my guy. So, Hot Squad, that is my conclusion of my reaction to John Jutsu's recap of Transformers and Resident Fallen. So, if you enjoyed this, please tell the share your thoughts. What's your favorite Transformers Bayformers movie, by the way? <laughs> Bayformers movie. And how many times have you seen Resident Fallen? And, um, oh, yeah, that's right. Transformers 1 is coming out next month, I believe. No, next month or September. So, you think it's going to be good? I might check out and see how it is. So, I did a trailer for that as well. And yeah, it looks pretty decent. It looks like it could be good. So yeah, Hot Squad. So please stay tuned because my Hot Banger recap marathon continues with Cool Ono 9's recap of Deadpool. So I'm excited to see that. It's been so long I've seen a Cool Ono recap. So Hot Squad, please stay tuned for that. <laughs>